Dijaksin. Depolarization of cardiac myocytes results in the opening of voltage-sensitive calcium channels, which allow the influx of significant amount of calcium ions into the cytoplasm. The external calcium ions stimulate the release of indigenous calcium ions from the cytoplasmic reticulum. Both external and internal calcium stimulate the contraction of myofibrils filaments. After the completion of their contractile mission, the calcium ions are reflected out of the myocytes through special calcium-sodium exchangers in return for the influx of sodium ions into the cardiac myocytes. Normally, sodium ions are driven out of the myocytes through sodium-potassium ATPase bombs, which simultaneously import potassium ions into the cardiac cytoplasm to keep ion balance. Dijoxin blocks sodium-potassium ATPase bombs. Therefore, large amounts of sodium are accumulated inside the myocytes. This change in concentration gradients disturbs the sodium-calcium exchangers. Therefore, more calcium will be trapped in the myocytes. The trapped calcium in turn will stimulate the forceful contraction of the heart muscles.